Right, so a few days ago, we were, um, I was out cleaning my boat and um, this lady walked past and said, do you fancy buying another boat? And it was like, um, what you got then? She goes, oh, we've got this old boat that we've got in the driveway. Uh, we haven't really had time to do it up. And um, so I said, how much do you want for it? She said, 500 quid. So I thought, oh, we're going to have a look. Didn't yeah, we look? went out, had a look and, and it's in good condition. Yeah, it wasn't too bad at all. So um, what we've ended up with is a, um, we thought it was a, um, a 535 Shetland. Um, it turns out it's a 1969, 69 um, uh, um, Shetland. So that was one of the first um, Shetlands they'd done, I believe. So we're learning lots at the moment. Yeah. So um, let's take let's, a look let's at Let's have her. a look. She needs a bit of re, um, renovation, yeah. doesn't she? Yeah, a bit of re renovation, but nice clean, but she looks good. Yeah, so we believe. So what we liked about it was all these uh, original fittings. So she's got some retro uh, cleats. cleats on her. Um, handrails all look original. Um, she hasn't, which, was, which we were amazed with, she hasn't been painted. So it's original gel coat. And we had a little quick play, and I don't know if you can see that, but um, that's all dull and that's all shiny, so we think she's going to come up nice. She needs a little bit of work on the inside, but considering it's an old boat, yeah, makes a lot of sense. So the plan, our first plan, is to um, strip it. Yeah. Get, get everything out. Get all these uh, these original fittings off. Look at the lovely fittings on that. And these um, they almost look like indicators, don't they? Look good. It does, yeah. And it's got this um, original original cable steering. Which does actually turn the steering wheel yeah, as does, well. It does, yeah. So, there you go. There you go. Perfect. And uh, what, we'd like, what we'd like to see here is look at the gauges on this. They all look totally original. Um, I can't see that that's ever been uh, played with in its time. The steering wheel looks uh, looks original. Um, so the plan is is to strip off all these parts and get them re uh, re chromed, refitted. Give the the hull a good polish. The she's inside. got water in her, so yeah. she she definitely holds water. <laughs> so she, she, she'll float, she hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> um, inside, she definitely needs a bit of work. She's um, she just needs all that uh, cleaning off. Um, so what the plan is is tonight is to try and get her in the garage, um, and then uh, start stripping her out, isn't it? Yeah, that is the idea. So but this is the uh, looks lovely, doesn't it? This is the before, and hopefully we'll be showing you the after soon. Yeah. It'll be, take quite a while, but we've got windows to get out, haven't we? Yeah, windows out. All needs to be. Oh, I've got to show you this. Painted uh, inside, doesn't it? Yeah, I've got to show you this. It's the uh, the plaque. So it says number seven one one Shetland, um, and the experts are telling us. We joined a, uh, a forum on uh, Facebook, and they're telling us it is a um, a sixty nine Shetland sixty nine early edition nineteen sixty nine build, and to be honest, I think. The only thing I think that's been changed, maybe, are these... Um, nav lights. Those nav lights. I've got a feeling they may have looked very similar <coughs> to these originally. I've got a feeling, and I think they would have been coloured. But they're made by Heller as well, so... Um, it'd be really interesting to find out a bit of history on her. And the tra um, trailer looks good, doesn't it? And the boat name is? I, f I can't remember now. It is Nomad 3. Nomad 3. Yeah, so we won't be changing that either. No, but the trailer looks good, doesn't it? Yeah, the trailer looks in... all right. <laughs> it looks some. So, new tyres. She looks old as well, doesn't she? Yeah. But uh, underneath. Doesn't um, look too bad. I'm really impressed. So, she's got a bit of star crazing, but you're going to get that, aren't we? So, yeah. It's, uh, what we want to do is try and keep her original. Um, take all these little fittings off, give that a really good buff up, get that gel coat shining again, the take end. the windows out, put new seals in, and I think she'll be ready to go then. Yeah. Is the inside? Yeah. Just needs a bit of work, done it, but yeah. get that looking nice. You get that water out, don't we? Yeah, that's one of the first jobs is 
empty. Let her dry out. Yeah. Get in there with a, uh, we'll get her jacked up. Get in there with a nice uh, sponge. Sponge, hands and knees, and get them dirty. Drying her out. Right, well that's the, uh, that's what we've got. Looks good. It does, yeah. She's good all round. All right. With the canopy. Yeah, she's got a canopy. She ain't got, we haven't got the, uh, the covers. The cover bit, have we? But we've got the frame. And this one's got a nice back seat that moves around as well, so. All right. Let's get her in the garage. Your first boat. My first boat. <laughs> Let's get her in the garage and get her away. With the other one. Let's hope she fits. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so the first job is to um, get this water out. Didn't realise actually how much was in her. So he jacked her up, and what we've got is a, um, a jiggy siphon. I don't know if you've ever seen one of these, but they're bloody brilliant. Um, and that's emptying the, uh, the water out pretty rapidly. No, I'm doing it by hand. Yeah, I think but, uh, yeah. I'd, wait, I'd wait for the jiggy siphon to clear. The jiggy's doing it quicker than I can. I think what we'll do is get this, um, this wooden, wooden board out. Shower. Yeah, there you go. There's a bucket full of water. Let's get this out. I'll be there in two seconds. That's the original, uh, the original door. And, right. And that paint, we'll look at getting a uh, like a wire fitting on that, taking it all off, and then just stripping that back, and then uh, taking that seal off, and then painting it. I think it's some white paint. It'll come up nice. But that this side, side looks amazing. Yeah, that's unbelievable, isn't it? Look at that. Nice polish. Yeah, that come out really well. Yeah. Got some stainless steel hinges on there. Can you see them? They've they're, um, been replaced before by the look of it. Jiggy's working all right. Yeah, that's flying out there. Look, it's got some air horns. Oh, have we? <laughs> got some horns. Got some horns. we we'll have to get them ready. Yeah. All right, so we get this um, crappy bit of wood out. Yeah. There's an old boat hook. Oh, can I reach it? Yeah. Oh, that. That looks pretty old itself, doesn't it? Yeah. Let's put it in the garage. To be fair, this looks really good as well. Yeah, what's that? The uh, the old old back seat. The old back seat, yeah. That looks really nice. Looks nice, right. doesn't it? The old battery box with it. Yeah. What's that got in it? A bit of rope. It might be a bit lighter now. <laughs> yeah, that's nearly cleared out all that water. Yeah, jiggy siphons flying out. Yeah, might put it. I don't know what you got in there, man. Huh? Right, so we've got most of the water out. As you can see, it probably definitely needs a good, good clean. But after we've taken the wooden plank out. Yeah, and then we'll get her in the garage and we'll make a start. Start. After the weekend, we've got a bit of time, hopefully. Yeah. Well, by hook or by crook, we managed to get her in the garage. Just. Um, yeah, you are right, Luke, just about. So, we can start stripping her down, give her a quick final clean out, um, but we'll uh, make a start next week, I think. Yeah, so we've literally got about a millimetre on one side. <laughs> if that. Yeah, just. <laughs> And the, we had to take the perspex off the roof, so it would fit, didn't we? Yeah. So now that's inside. It was just a quick unbolt it, and then she fits. Yeah. I need a bigger garage. I believe we do. Not a bigger boat. No, we've got one in there, and yeah. now two. Yeah. All right. All right, six, six outboard, yeah. six horsepower. All ready. Ready to launch. <laughs> right. It's a good start anyway. Yeah. Thanks for watching episode one. Keep an eye out for episode two, where we'll be stripping the boat bare, ready for polishing. If you've enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Very much appreciated. Take care.